Look at this. Hello. Have you heard anything about a girl called Mia who was captured by the Ardanians recently? Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm only really interested in plants. I don't keep up in the latest rumors. I want to pick up a bot botanist in Ardain, but my parents keep saying it's too dangerous. It's been a whole decade now since Ardain and Uriah ceased hostilities. I'm sure there's been this nasty group called Torna popping up in the news lately, but still. It's not like anything bad's gonna ha happen where more Dane's in charge. Doesn't this people in town prove, prove that? right here. Well, have you heard anything about a girl called Nia? She was kept was captured by the Ardenian Ardenians recently. Yeah, I heard about that. The Ardenian dude was just saying they were going to ex ex execute the prisoner within a few days. These Torna guys are pretty bad, right? I heard they killed loads of drivers to steal their core crystals. Pretty amazing if the Empire have really captured one of them. Empire is so cool. I wonder what they'll do with this execution thing anyway. I've never seen them before. I gotta go see it for myself. You got you guys should come along too. Thank you so much. Where's the execution? So that's not actually gonna happen, but when did it get so late? Oh, and I've started glowing. I'm a bit self-conscious. Boy. Wait, oh, yeah, I've heard some interesting things. The corner member that the Ardenian Empire captured was some Gromati girl named Alnia. That name seems familiar somehow. Didn't the Lord, old Lord of Etchel a decade ago so ha so go have I believe that let's not talk about that. Not a happy thing to think about. Thanks. This person, they're up here, I think. Julia, oh. forget about that. Did you know this? Apparently, whenever a new blade is born, it has to be registered with the Corium of Indol. Wow, that's really interesting. Yeah, so I bet the guy who just got scouted to be a driver will have to go there sooner or later. When I grow up, I want to become a driver and visit Indol too. Did Vecprex know? They were recruiting over there for new drivers. Yeah, I saw that earlier when we first arrived in the city. Vecprex should try too. Chance of success basically 100%. Wanted by the Ardenian Empire right now, remember? It seems like a bad idea to make itself conspicuous. Vecprex make a good point. Oh, I was just too curious to see what kind of blade Rex Rex awakened. At any rate, I don't need to awaken a blade, do I? I've already got Pyra. 
Come now, Rex. Don't tell me you thought drivers could only bond with a single blade. What? Is that not right? Not at all. Many drivers have more than one. Neogon, that we're a bit short on numbers right now, we might not hold up all that well in the fight. Perhaps it would actually be a good idea to get yourself a new blade. A new blade opens up new possibilities in battle after all. Hmm. It would stop you from putting so much strain on Pyra as well. Seems like a good thing all around if you, if you ask me. Well, if Pyra doesn't mind, I guess we could, we could try. I don't have any objections. The more the merrier. And it's settled. But the question is, where are we going to get ourselves a core crystal? Now that's one question I can't answer. I just happen to have one stored away for such an occasion. Where Gramps hides hide core crystal in such a small body? The key to awakening a new blade is to foster a res powerful resonance with the driver's spirit. Focus your whole mind on the core crystal as you touch it. When you try to hold a clear picture in your mind of what blade, blade you wish to awaken. I'm not sure if I really understand, but I'll give it a try. Let's get Cosmos! I hope you awaken a wonderful new blade. Probably just get a common. Yeah. Nothing, nothing fantastic, honestly. Oh my. Why? I don't want her. Change back to Nobia. I've been so bored. I was about to go out hunting solo. Feel its chest here. Treasure acquired. Or core crystals. Ooh. Have you heard it? Anything about a girl called Nia who was recently who was captured by the Ardenians recently? Who are you people? Uh oh, maybe it wasn't a good idea to ask an Ardenian soldier. Um, there was something I wanted to ask, but now I clean forgot what what it was. Hmm. If it's important, if it's information you're after, go pay for it at a local informant. Fighting with the populace is our job, you understand. Let's, show Let's them kill you in a second. Let's give him a taste of some good old twist smackdown. Strong smash. That's it now for me! Ha! Wicked arts! Why not? Focus! This no effect! This is why I can't get enough of fighting! My thoughts exactly. Pyra, leave it to me. Ha! Rolling smash. Our emotions are in tune, Rex. Nice. <laughs> Easy peasy. Oh, it's fun to bully him. I'm on. right. I think Can't that's what your name is. Kind of have you heard anything about a girl called Nia who was captured by the Ardenians recently? I don't know anything about that. But the grown ups do seem to be talking about secret, complicated stuff a lot, a lot lately. Apparently, there are some kind of dangerous people causing trouble. It's only been 10 years since the war between Moradin and Uriah ended, but why would they stir up more trouble? Sounds like real pain. 
help the Ardenian soldiers be able to protect us. Sign on. Kuruni. Have you heard anything about a girl called Mia? She was captured by the Ardanians recently. Kuruni, no, this of course. Kuruni is, is important by trade. She cannot provide information without proper compensation. Thanks much for custom. Besides the battleship, Gormachi girl being held prisoner. Fortunately, Turuni did not yet receive intelligence specifying a prisoner name. But rumor say it should provide for the full purpose of holding a one easy girl. People of Gormat gang along quite well with Empire nowadays. The trouble like this is not very well. Not very welcome. That seems the opinion of most Torgoth. That's a bit. That about extent of the information true, you know. Enough to satisfy friends. Thanks. Race to find me a Please. Head back. The Torah's house. I'm gonna do some salvage. Quick. Buy some cylinders. jellies as well. Or I get that though. It's back in uh, our Jetson, I think. Oh, I can't. I will back here just really quick. Whew. Let's rest the spell. Bother, bother. I can't use Milponad's muscle. And I can't just ask Gardanians. Something wrong? Hmm? Oh, hi. Well, actually, I got the cargo in the harbor but I brought, that I brought from Raya to trade, but never so slight nuisance. A good guess. 
that it's not exactly a person. It seems that Trent Crabbles love the stuff I'm transporting. To get it, they clamber on deck and they steal the try to steal the cargo. I hired some goons and stand guard, but they all got done in. So I'm out here now, looking for someone to replace them. But I'm having no luck so far, so it's starting to feel a bit dire. We're going to help, right, Rex? Of course. Let's do everything we can. The thing you will take to the job? It's bunch, pal. You're one in a million. The cargo's in Gold Goldmouth Return Port. It's pretty large. You can't miss it. It'd be great if you could chase off the thieving Trent Crabbles. Thanks in advance. Rex, shall we get to work on this right away? With you by my side, Pyra. I'm up to any challenge. Yeah, all the quests I can in here. Hi there. Yo. We were just about to play hide and seek. Can't need anything. Can't have to come late have to come later. Wait, friend. Maybe you look like friend would play with us? Oh, that not occurred to me. Oh if you insist, it's okay, we can all play together. But you're seeking first. Leave it to me. Wow, we were eager. Okay, may explain the rules. In the area is anywhere on Goldmouth ground level. We include higher floors, the game goes on for, for days and days. And Mum and Pong get angry. Anyhow, we when find everyone, we be back here in Bower Lounge. Got it? Roger. Playing area not big, but be very good at hiding. Friend, no, think it go easy. Yeah, we play hide and seek every day. We'll hide like there's no tomorrow. Okay, we go hide now. So, friend, count 100 before looking. Yes. Sure. Sneaky sneaky. I'm a man. But sneaky sneaky, not. No descript. No non descripts. Usually hard to find even when not hiding properly. <laughs> Pretty impressive, right? Friend, have, friend must have amazing power of observation. Okay, sneaky sneaky, go ahead and wait in Bower Lounge. There's the other kid. I get up there somehow though. There we go. Ah, oh, Rex, you found, found me already? I was so sure I had the perfect hiding place as well. So lame. Uh huh. Ah, oh, whatever. I'm just. Glad you didn't take it easy on me. Okay, I'll go wait in Bower Lounge. Huh. Here's that jelly. Buy a bunch of them. Oh, 
How did we get up there? Ah, I see. Treasure acquired. I'm an expert on all things Napon. Calm your mind. Structural analysis in progress. There. That should do it. Nice. Not bad. Get that coin. Don't need it. Is it deadly? In the barrel, huh? Friend find me in that cask? Right there. Please excuse. Tell the Lulu's one who wasn't there. Absent and sneak and sneak and never find Telulu here. Eyes of friend must be very strong. Meh. So Pelu was last? Okay, let me go back to our lounge now. Head back. Everyone here now. Ben find Talulu already? Yes, friend is hide and seek genius. Here, here. Anyhow, thank for friend thank friend for playing. No problem at all. And then, have you had to say thank you? Yeah yeah, I was gonna. Thanks for playing. My parents are both a bit too busy to play with me ever. Today was really fun. Really, really, thanks for playing with us. You can come play with us anytime. Doctor. Um, here is a thank you gift from Sneaky Sneaky and Friends. It's like scrap of treasure for us. Or maybe it's just scrap. Anywho, please take. Thank you so much. Alright then, I guess we've got places to go. Come and play again. See you around. Let's okay, head back to Gormot then. Anything here now that I've got the jelly. Whew. Let's rest a spell. Nia and Dromark executed. It doesn't bear thinking about. But getting aboard that warship will be no mean feat. We're going to need an ironclad plan. Army Thought is under heavy guard. I guess we'll just have to mount a full on attack. No, Rex, we can't put everyone in danger. Right, sorry.
There. This is one of the Grand Arbor's routes, right? If this map is correct, it goes all the way from the key to the hull of the warship. And here, it looks like some kind of cargo entrance. Could we sneak on that way? Oh, right. No one will spot us if we sneak in from below. Security light around this entrance. At night, not even workers here. Looks like this is our only option. Then it's a plan. <laughs> Tora? Tora have something to show you. Poppy. What's this then? Nobody ever see this before. Secret of Tora. An artificial blade. An artificial blade? I can't believe it. Tora have always wanted to be driver of blade. But Tora... Uh, Tora has no potential to awaken Core Crystal. How could you know that? Surely you just have to try and... Oh. You did, didn't you? Yes, one year ago. Tora applied to drive a recruitment man. Oh, dearie me. Oh, Tora, you mean you... It was bad. Tora had nosebleed for three days. Just a nosebleed? What you mean, just? People die from loss of blood, you know? Yeah, but from a nosebleed. Nosebleed. Anyway, moving on. It's a nosebleed. For a near-death experience, you're awfully casual about this. Anyway, back to Tora's blade. When complete, even no potential Tora can be a driver. This is simply incredible. You built this blade from scratch, Tora? It was started by Grampy Pon and Dada Pon. But Grampy Pon die, and Tora still not know where Dada Pon go to. Oh. So Tora will finish Blade myself and become a driver like always wanted. Then. Dad upon hear about Tora's success and come back home, yes? Oh, Tora. By the by, Tora, this blade, as far as I can see, it looks complete. What is there left to do? <laughs> All Tora have left to do is buy missing parts. But Tora have no money at all. Oh, really? Really? Nothing. At all? Not even one gold. So you're asking for a loan? Uh, not loan. <laughs> um, closer to generous donation. Just like a nopon. <laughs> Always shrewd when it comes to gold. But, but, but if Tora completes artificial blade, combat capabilities will be big help on mission. Well, yeah. If it works, you may have a point. So, how much exactly do you need? Oh, no more than 60,000 gold. I mean, we have that, so it's not too bad, but, well. like, story-wise, I know. Max. At this point, we only have, like, a thousand or something like that. If it's just money he needs, I may be able to assist. Assist? How exactly? Nothing illegal? I pull? Don't even joke, Gramps. This is a natural crystal. It should fetch around 60,000. No way. We can't let you sell that. But... No, it wouldn't be right. That's it. I'm paying for the parts myself. Very admirable. Meh, meh! Rex Rex is too generous! This blade of yours had better be seriously useful, though, Tora. Ha! Leave that to Tora! Well then, let's go, I guess. Yippee! Will they really be okay? I suppose they'll have to be. What do you actually need to finish this artificial blade? 
One perfect range sensor and three bion connectors. I don't think I've heard of either of those. Perfect range sensor supplements functional divides and artificial blade. Quite a pricey item, but very important. And the bion connect connectors. Not have many uses, but mostly to pre prevent hat fall off. Would an ordinary piece of string not suffice? So, um, where can we buy these items? At Margie's Odds and End. Just off the, off to the left after entering Korgoth City. I'm sure we must have walked up that area before. All right, let's go. What have we here? Three watching points. Hi there. Some big wig and more ordained names put about boatload and aborders in and now I don't even have time to scratch myself. All my furniture is made to order, you see. I use only the finest gourmet gourmet lumber to make the make our customers' furniture related dreams come true. Wow, pretty impressive. Hmm, actually I haven't seen you a lot around here. Are you tourists? Yeah. Any chance you might have seen my son Polly on your way here? Er, uh, no. Ah, uh, okay. It's just that normally he w should have come home by now. Really? I asked him to run an errand for me, you see, and he's not back yet. He's just a kid, so I can let him off with a little meandering, but sometimes you can't help but worry, you know? I'm negotiating some sort of deadline extension with our ordained client, but no dice. Not only that, they even threatened to sue me for all I've done. For all I have if I don't make the delivery, so I can't go look at myself. People people these days talking about public order so they, so much that they forget about human forget hu basic human decency. Ah, beg pardon. There I go again, mopping off at poor travelers. Please pay me with no mind. I'm sure it'll be fine. We're going to help, right, Rex? Of course, let's do everything we can. Oh? No, oh, please, I couldn't possibly ask you to. No worries. Ah, well, thank you then. My boy Polly was headed off to the way tree, I believe. Hope you'll find them okay. Let's uh the story stuff first. Quick. I help well hello there. We're here to buy perfect range sensor and bion connectors. You're the young the one who was gazed Anything longly at those the other day. And uh, you noticed? Well, considering you were staring for three straight hours. I'm dreadfully sorry, but we're all out of perfect range sensors right now. Still got we got plenty of bion connectors still though. They're four four thousand G a piece. Twelve thousand for three of them, huh? That really is pretty pricey. XRX promise to pay for all not. No backseats. I mean, sure, I'm not about to go back on my word, but, hmm. Are you one of the salvagers? Yep, I may not look it, but I'm actually pretty, actually professional at it. 
And maybe you could get a bion connector that way. Apparently they fish the things up quite regularly around the sea this season. That's not a bad idea. Go give it a try. Good luck, Rex Rex. I'll um cheer you on too. Probably buy him. We not salvage that as well. I think I've heard any like spots for those lately. They're almost impossible to find except when the patterns in the clouds be aligned exactly the right way. And even if we fi did find a spot where the figure might show up, we need a lot of luck to actually buy one. We don't exactly have time to waste, so perhaps salvaging isn't the answer. Hey, can I ask you something? The looks of it, this young lady here is driver in your... Huh? Or is that what it looks like? Wait one moment, please. Rex Rex and Tora also... Tora also played as well. Does that make me the driver? Surely the driver would have to be me. Can we at least... Can we try to be a little believable here? You know, we need to sort out, sort out our stories. Hey now, no need to get your knickers in a twist. Mr. Regular Botanist. Botanist? We never guessed. We get that a lot. Thing is, I was heading to Last Gen Island for a lot of field work, and I ran into a bit of monster trouble. I try asking the Imperial Army to help me out, but it looks like they're pretty busy right now. I figure if you lot are decent at fighting, maybe you could take care of the issue for me. If you could help me out, I might just be able to spare a perfect rage sister I've got lying around in storage. Well, that sounds perfect. Yeah, we'll see what we can do. Last Cham Island isn't hard to find. You can see it if you... You can see it to the left as you exit the city through the main entrance. Just take care of the jumping cowboy you find there. And be careful, they can be vicious. Artificial Blaze Part 2. Yes. I got the bion connectors, got enough money for those, so it's no problem at all, really. This guy got the perfect range sensor now. The uh, head back to Horagaki. Like, I wanna go to the inn. I can take care of the, uh, cats. We're here! So, shall we?
wish I could, didn't have to go back to the inn whenever I needed to uh, change my level because it's a bit inconvenient Morning, Rex. right now. Did you sleep okay? Ugh, I slept like a baby. Come out, come out. Milk, milk. Huh. Milk, milk. It's a new day, everyone. Good morning. It's a new Rise day, everyone. Yeah. That's what you mean by bring your pay off. Huh? It's fine, we'll get them yet. Don't push yourself too hard. Let's show them a thing or three. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Much obliged. Ha! Push down. Rolling smash. Let's keep this up. Spinning we'll for sure. Anchor shot. Ha! We'll get them yet. Don't push yourself too hard. Let's show them a thing or three. Double spinning edge. Rolling smash. Our emotions yeah. are in tune, Rex. Yeah. I like your attitude. I like your attitude. And push down. Ha! We may not win this one. Don. Why here? It's fine. We'll get them yet. Maybe Don't push to yourself too hard. That uh, jelly. Be so lucky. Okay, time to take you down. We can ha! do this together. Ha! Ha! Oh, no, you don't. Much obliged. Rush Double down. spinning edge. Let's Rolling keep this up and we'll win for sure. Anchor shot. Ha! Eagle eye. Why not? Why not? Ha! Yeah! Double spinning edge! My Anchor power shot. is to finish ha. this! Go, As go you for wish. it! Flame Nova! Why not? It's okay! Why not? Much obliged! You don't stand a chance against us now! Yeah! Rex, maybe you should slow down! Ow. Nah, I can keep going! Rolling smash! Anchor shot! Ha! Yeah, I definitely need a big right. party. Out of juice! Even with one forty three and we'll jelly. Yet. Don't push yourself too hard. I'll just uh do the finish the quest off. Uh 
Unless the monster said when he's talking about. Doesn't look like a pushover, that's for sure. Or I wish could help too, but probably not much you good for anything other than decoy lure. No need for any of that. We can handle th this one just fine, right, Pyra? Absolutely. No need to rely on just my power, though. We should make full use of all your blades. Indeed. You may only have one driver, but twice the blades means twice the potential. Good point, I remember that. Alright, let's do this. Okay, bring it on. Rolling smash! Let's keep Don't this up and head. for sure. A lot have you considered taking the lead sometime, Ira? I'll think about it next time, Zerda. People might look at you funny though, so watch out. Time for some treasure hunting. Look. Oh, dog! Hi there again. This looks like it'll be something good. Feel. If they seek a fight, they shall get one. This up and we'll win. That was wonderful. Nice, right? that crystal. Really? I'll try even harder for the next one. Just you wait. Pain of keys. Time for some treasure hunting. Oops. Dang. Didn't quite get that one. I'm back. Miss me. Okay, bring it on. Ha! Rolling smash! Double spinning eagle eye! Why not? Let's keep this yeah. up and we'll win ha. for sure. Rush down! Double spinning edge! Rolling smash! If the word is not the least my fun. Go it. for it! Let's do this! Ow. Why not? Yeah. It's okay! Now let's do it. Maybe you should slow down. It's getting tough. Why not? I'm all Dang it. out of juice. It's fine. We'll get them yet. All right, let's Don't just head back to town. So, shall we? Hey, you're back. You got the jumping crab, did you? You know I get made the right call asking you guys. You're the perfect rage sensor, as promised. Thanks. Had it laying around. Lying around since my grandpa's generation, so it's a bit dusty, but it should work just fine. Thanks for all your help. Everything should be fine now. Got all the parts. Let's get another quest here. You know the shop called Little Two Greens? The girl there, the girl who works there, Ten, she's such a bright and cheerful lass, but last month she lost her father. Her mother succumbed to illness a while ago. It was just the two of them. I feel so bad for her now, all alone. He's just got, he's got the brains to put out new products, but no, no problem. But running a shop by herself must be hard. As you can probably tell, I'm worried about her, so I'd like to save her business. Here are the details. First of all, buy one piece of every product that's on offer. That'll let Ten know you mean well. What that means is she'll let you buy the deed deeds to the show greens. When you do that, 
you will become the shop's owner. With me so far? Well, when I say owner, I don't mean like sharing the profits, but relax. There's plenty of benefits to it still. Then we'll be relieved to know that someone like you has her back and she'll be able to get on with, the, get on with things. And you'll get special booms too. For example, things like making harvesting easier or running faster. How about it? Can I count on you? Rex, shall, shall we get to work on this right away? See you by my side, Pyra. I'm up to any challenge. That's the right, that's the right answer. Like I, like I said before, then. First, buy the whole selection of goods at the shop. Including the new period leaf salad, of course. Well, off you go. I believe we already did this. Thank you. It feels really great to see Ten smiling again. She's always been cheerful and kind, but also kind of stubborn. I know she doesn't need her old friends like me looking over her shoulder, but she can stand on her own feet. I know this, I know this but still, I can't help being a little worried, can I? I just want to give her a hand. It's a bit. With your help, I think she will have found the, the coffee that she needs for the shop she inherited to thrive. Looks like everything worked out. Oh, and also, you know, it's not just Ted's shop, right? Other businesses work much the same way. Buy every item they have, and they'll start offering sell you their deeds. Buy that, and you'll get a nice fat bandage. Different ones to hang on the shop. Ah, one word of warning though. Not every shop that I'll offer all, all the products from the get go, you do in fact. In those cases, you'll need to raise the development level before they'll send everything. Then you get the deeds. And sometimes, if they don't seem to offer the deeds no matter what, it's worth trying again in a little bit. Oh. Oh, sorry to keep you so long. I can stop being such a busybody now. You have my gratitude. Thanks for everything. Thank you so much. You know, every shop here with their deeds, but they don't let me. Okay, all finished. 
it's really complete. Very complete. Just need to apply energy charge to activate. Tora, our friend's execution draws near. There's no time to lose. Make haste. I know, I know. Oh, okay, artificial blade. It's wakey wakey that time. Won't do, Tora. What what Tora do wrong? You can't keep calling her artificial blade. As her creator, the least you can do is give her a proper name. Oh, um, well. Actually, friends, Tora did think of name for her. Very good name. Nice. Then I guess there's no problem. Well, why don't you introduce us, Tora? Right away! Now, wakey wakey! Tora's very own blade! Ooh, Poppy! <laughs> Here it comes. Poppy? Poppy. Oh, 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 oh. Wait a minute. What? Oh, forget you right. see that. Tora That's the crack settings. The settings. <clears throat> the settings. Uh, this time should be okay. Second time go best. Puppy! Whoa! Right, that means we get a uh, cutie really cutie pie. This is Tora did plus. Good, huh? You impressed? Tora is a very big success. Absolutely. You're amazing, Tora. Though I was pretty surprised before when she was all, you know. Forget about it. That's not Tora's fault. Th that was um, Grumpy Pond. Grampy Bond Susie made settings. <laughs> yes, definitely Grampy Bond's fault. Are you sure, Tora? Yes, Grampy Bond. <clears throat> yes. You've been found out, Tora. What do you have to say for yourself? Try hard to make Master Pond proud. 